New tonight at 10 o'clock, neighbors are worried after somebody shot up a home in Fulshire. Now, these are pictures of the damage. You can clearly see the bullet homes. That home is in the Cross Creek Ranch subdivision, where neighbors say something like this is very unusual. Our Keith Garvin is joining us live now. Keith, those neighbors have to be worried. Oh, Bill, they are. As a matter of fact, several of them have told us that they are on edge after this shooting. And now after the shooting, the peace that they normally feel has been somewhat disrupted. So we are very surprised and concerned as well. As the families in the Fulshire neighborhood of Cross Creek Ranch prepare for Thanksgiving and the rest of the holiday season, their concerns have been raised after what's being investigated as a drive-by shooting. Simply put, drive-bys in Cross Creek just don't happen. This is really, really quite a uh, neighborhood. Uh, we know our neighbors, we know what happens here, so really unusual. Police tell us that just after midnight Monday morning, they were called to this home on the 27,300 block of Aspen Falls after someone reported shots being fired. Finding no evidence, officers left. But this and other damage was discovered the next morning. Police were called back, and that's when they determined someone had fired several shots. That house has been vacant for a while. I understand that it's a rental. Uh, I can understand why somebody wants to shot six shots at a, at a door of a rental. In fact, police say the home had been vacant for three weeks at the time of the shooting. Officers have now increased patrols in the entire Cross Creek neighborhood, but the people who live here still want to know how this shooting could have happened here. Everything right now is gossip. So everything that comes to me is basically on Facebook and everybody's saying a different story, so I have no idea. And investigators say they don't have much in the way of descriptions right now, but they do say there were reports of a small white SUV driving through the area at the time of the shooting. Reporting live from Fulshire, Keith Garvin, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank